Skin the Heart Away, Southern Tea, and I'm back this morning, and I'm finna get right into it. I don't need no notes for this. I don't need to jot nothing down. All this shit coming right off the top of the head because this some shit that I've been, uh, you know, thinking about, you know, for a minute now. Not even thinking about, just noticing, subconsciously thinking about. Uh, and and I'ma preface this video by saying, I ain't no Manny Pacquiao hater. I'm a Manny Pacquiao fan. Manny the Great, Manny the Great Pacquiao. Not a Manny Pacquiao hate video. Manny Pacquiao is a legend in the sport, and truthfully, he could do whatever he want to do in the sport. But my problem, my only problem with Manny Pacquiao right now in 2020-21 is he's doing everything he want to do, but at the same time, he's holding up the 147-pound division because uh, very impressive, very, very impressive. His win over Keith Thurman was very impressive, but in Manny Pacquiao actually winning that fight, uh, he's holding up unification within 147. And I know you, I know y'all asking, uh, skinny, sudden T, why you say that? Um, at this point, I don't feel like Manny's direction is, you know, fight the best fighters, you know, best fight the best. You know, that's what we want. I don't think that's Manny's goal right now, you know, like he's been for the most of his career, like he's been, you know, every other time in his career. Uh, Manny has never been a guy who dodged smoke, who didn't fight that guy, who didn't fight this guy. Manny's resume is impeccable. Manny probably has the best resume in fucking boxing from start to finish. You know, when you look at it from this generation to this generation to that generation, Manny got the biggest names in like two or three generations on his resume. You know what I'm saying? He got like two or three generations worth of names on his resume. So I understand, I can't understand Manny, you know, you know, uh, chasing the money. You're not even chasing the money because Manny is the money. You know, I can understand Manny making the money here, making the money there, and doing all that. But the fact that he beat Keith Thurman, uh, he has an actual major belt still to this day at age 42, which is amazing in itself. Manny Pacquiao at the age 42 or 43, however old Manny Pacquiao is, has a major belt. Still today, he had a major belt <laughs> when I was 10, and I'm damn near 30, and he got a major belt. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, Manny Pacquiao is one of the greats. So, so let's not get it twisted. My only problem with Manny is I, I either need him to fight Spence. I need him. Baby, shut up. I need him to fight Spence, or I need him to fight Bud. Preferably, I need him to fight Bud. Because Spence is already a unified champ, a double belt champ. And I want to see Spence versus Bud. And Spence versus Bud is a bigger fight if Bud has a WBO and a WBA instead of just the WBO that Manny Pacquiao has. And I'm hearing Manny Pacquiao is about to fight Ryan Garcia, who fights at 130. 135. I mean, he fights at 135. Ryan Garcia fights at 135. Manny Pacquiao. We want Bud Spence for all the marbles. See, y'all want Bud Spence. Y'all want Bud Spence. Y'all want Bud Spence. I want Bud Spence for all the marbles. Who are the best two fighters at 147? Earl Spence. Turns Bud Crawford. I don't just want to see them fight. I want to see them fight in the mega fight, in the biggest fight possible. Or if Manny is still better than Better than them guys. Manny, I need you, which is why I'm here, Manny. I need you to fight Spence or Bud. You and Bud been dancing with each other for seven years. Y'all been dancing around with each other for seven years. And you uh, you, you came to the ring. I ain't going to say you hopped in the ring with Spence because you didn't want to go to the ring. I had never seen Manny Pacquiao look, you know, like he didn't want smoke with a fighter his whole career. When Spence called Manny to the ring, Manny had a look on his face like, bro, I do not want to be here. That's the first time I seen some breaking Manny. Manny wanted to fight uh, Floyd Mayweather. He he had no problem fighting Floyd Mayweather. I didn't see a scared Manny Pacquiao once. Uh, you know, at, at any time him and Floyd were discussing the fight or having they, uh, you know, back and forth, whatever they was having. But um, I, I'm starting to feel like... Uh, Manny Pacquiao don't really want smoke with uh, Bud Crawford or Earl Spence. 
I think he has to say that, but I don't think he really, you know, wants that action. And if he does want it, he's not acting like a fighter who wants to unify. <clears throat> it's not even about Bud or Earl. It's about unification. Earl already has two titles in that division. Bud and Pacquiao has the other. Bud and Pacquiao both had their belts for a year or two. They both, every, all of them, Earl too, they all had their belts for over a year. A year or two. A year, close to two years. You know what I mean? Why haven't, why haven't any of those guys got the dancing yet? You know what I mean? And everybody's pushing. Yeah, we want Earl Spence. We want Earl, we want Earl and Bud. We want Earl versus Bud. We want Earl versus Bud. Yeah, me, yeah, me too. But y'all forgetting that Manny is still a champion too. Manny has the other belt. I want Spence versus Bud too, but I want Spence versus Bud the right way. And if it's going to happen the right way, Earl has two belts, and I need those other two champions to unify their belts. And if and if Manny fights uh, Ryan Garcia like I'm hearing now, I believe Manny should be stripped of the WBA belt, and they should give it to, you know, have a you know a fight. They just let uh <clears throat> let Bud and Ugas fight for it or something like that. You know what I mean? But uh, if Manny fights Ryan Garcia. At 140 or wherever they're supposed to be fighting it, 145, wherever they're fighting it, uh, I believe the WB should strip the great man in Pacquiao. And um, that's just how I feel. Uh, I don't, just be real, Manny has no intention of fighting those guys. He's not, is Manny moving like a fighter that wants to fight one of those guys? And I hope I'm wrong. I hope I'm wrong. I hope I'm wrong because. I think Manny is great. Manny still going to be great whether he fights the old guys or not. My only problem with it is I just want unification at 147. I want him to come up off the belt. I want him to fight those guys or come up off the belt. And if, and if, and if fighting Ryan Garcia means that possibly the w, WBA might strip him and get him off the belt, then that's fine with me. That's fine with me too. I don't care. I personally just want to see uh, – you know, unification at 147. I want to see Buzz Spence just like everybody else. But I want to see Buzz Spence at the highest level. I want to see those two brothers fight each other for all the marbles. Uh, I want it in, in Texas or Vegas, wherever they go fight it. I want everybody to be there. And I want it to be for everything. I want it to be an event. I want it to be like a barbecue. And y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. I want it to be like a barbecue when those two guys fight. I don't want no half-stepping this, half-stepping that. Because I know who the two best welterweights are. At least I believe I know who the two best welterweights are in the world. Spence and Bud Crawford. It's, but it's three welterweight champions. Spence, Bud Crawford, and Manny Pacquiao. The great Manny Pacquiao. So I need the great Manny Pacquiao to fight Bud for the WBO and the WBA. <clears throat> and I need the winner of that fight to fight Spence. And it's just like that. And that's how we'll get our Bud... Versus Spence, and we having this big problem with, with with Earl, with Earl and Spence about the 60, 40, 50, 50. My Bud, if Bud be many, our Bud getting 50, 50. Bud getting 50, 50 straight like that. That's that's a 50, 50 fight. If Bud be many, that's a 50, 50 fight. And ain't nothing, ain't shit Earl can say. But right now, Terrence Crawford need to go and take that 60, 40 because that just is what it is. But I truly want. Manny Pacquiao and Bud to fight before a Earl Spence Bud uh, Crawford fight ever goes down, because I want Spence and Bud to be for all the, all the marbles. Uh, so I just need Manny to either fight to unify belt and leave Ryan Garcia alone at one thirty five, or I need him to, or I need the WBA to strip him. I understand Manny can do what he want to do. Man, he's earned the right to do what he want to do. Do what you want to do, bro. But uh, come up off that belt. But uh, I'm finna get up out of here. Skin the heart away. Sudden tea. This ain't the past. This ain't the future. But this the present. And I'm out.